Greetings from Bethel Memorial Baptist Church. I'm Pastor Brent, and it is the evening before Thanksgiving. And we had a testimony service at church and on Zoom. And even though I was a little fearful of how it would turn out, things went very well right up until the very end. And things just didn't seem to work. And we sang the doxology and, and closed the meeting. I was blessed by the testimonies that were shared, praising the Lord in, in very concerning, disconcerting times. People facing personal issues, people looking at the situation we see in the world, and, and just remembering that we can give God thanks. And I was blessed by that. And then also many people thankful for church family, for, I'm not talking just about Bethel, but brother, brothers and sisters and, that are believers that encourage us in our time of need. God is strong, but he chooses to use his people. And it was a blessing tonight to hear how so many people were praising him and thanking him for what he's doing in their lives. I have a verse that I want to share with you uh, that I think uh, just challenges me this Thanksgiving as I think about a number of themes that it deals with. But first, let me let me open up in a word of prayer. Father, I praise you. I praise you for your your care and, and love and the way you reveal yourself to us through believers, through your power, through so many different circumstances. I pray that you will bless us as we look into this word, this verse, and I pray that you would not allow me as a sinner to get in the way of what you want to share with us right now. It's in Jesus' name we, we pray. Amen. Psalm 28, 7. The Lord is my strength and my shield. In him my heart trusts and I am helped. My heart exalts and with God and with my song, I give thanks to him. What does it mean? The Lord is my strength. I think about fact is without him, we can do nothing. That's a song that I remember singing when I was in college. Uh, and it's just a reminder that rings through my, I cannot do anything. Anything, any power that I think I have comes from him. He is my strength. What does it mean that the Lord is my shield? He protects me from things I don't even know about. He prevents things that could have happened. And I complain about the things that did happen, but there are so many things that the enemy wants to do to us. And God is always a shield to us. The blessing that I think about with this verse is the more I sense his strength and protection, the more I trust him. And the more I trust him, I can find his help. I don't even like that thought about being helped. I want God to do it, but he does allow me to cooperate with him. So the more I sense his strength and protection in my life, the more my faith will grow and I will find his help in day-to-day -day challenges. My heart exalts and with my song. I want to think about so many times it's easy to sing a song and your heart's not fully in it. This verse suggests make sure your heart's right and then sing. Now, sometimes you could start singing and it'll lead your heart where it wants to go, but make sure you're not just put singing words, but you're really allowing God to speak to your heart. My song should come from the heart. And then that last phrase, so appropriate for Thanksgiving, I give thanks to him. Just from this verse, I give thanks to him for power, his strength, for protection, being a shield, for faith, as my heart trusts him more, for help. I thank him for an exultant heart that truly sings his praise. I pray that you can enjoy your time with the Lord and family uh, in, in your Thanksgiving celebration, and that you would know that it's all about him first of all, and then the blessings that he shares with us in, as, as he is our creator and savior God. Father, I thank you. I pray that you would help us to, to let you get into our hearts so that we can truly sing your praise. Let our heart exalt in you. Let our heart trust in you because of the, the power and protection you provide for us, the help that you give us. We thank you for the psalmist and ask that you would help us to live out what he wrote in this verse. I praise you, Father. It's in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. God bless and happy Thanksgiving.